Let, let us know when we grab this light real quick. Go back to man. Yeah. You want the other one? Uh, well, we'll just start with you for right now. Are we in? How's it? How uh, you look looking good. I got to turn it a little tiny bit. Are we good? There, oh, there you go. You uh-huh. All right, we're coming to you live. Well, I tell you what, the festivities are over. Magic Johnson just gave a rousing presentation down here. We're at the Duke Energy Convention Center. Of course, my name is Ed Williams. Coming to you live from the connecting spot. It was the Mercy Health Black History Month celebration. Celebrating history while making history. And I'm actually here with one of the young men, one of the ball players from Walnut Hills High School. How ironic. Eagles in the house, class 89. Class of 2015. Class of 2015. Careful, whatever. <laughs> I'm old, man. <laughs> but this was one of the young brothers that Magic Johnson had an opportunity to talk to. Actually, the first young man that Magic Johnson spoke with gave you some really, really good advice. So talk. About, well, first off, tell me your name. Crayfa. Crayfa. Yes. Yes. And tell, tell, tell our viewing audience out there a little bit about some of the advice Magic Johnson gave you. Well, he really just told us that basketball is not the only thing that we can do in life. And once basketball is over, you have to have a second option. And so. Put a lasting impression that school is really important and that you need to go to college to get your education. To do, to do the things you want to do in life and live a lavish life. Yeah, absolutely so. Now the irony is that Walnut Hills, even though it is a urban school, a public school, is one of the top 100 educational schools in the country. So not only are you obviously going to be excel in athletics, but you are also going to get a very good quality education. Yes, are you a junior or a senior this year? Junior. You're a junior. So have you already started uh, with college enrollments and uh, taking all of your admitting, uh, your, um, your college uh, entrance test? Uh, well, we just start the process. Okay. So right now we're just we're trying to limit down the colleges we want to apply for and begin with the senior. Got it. Got it. What position do you play? Center. You play center. Okay. And what are you, 6'4"? Six, yes, 6'4". Four. 6'4". Six, four. Okay, nice, nice. What's your, what's your uh, rebound for game? Uh, four points. Now do you start? Yes, sir. Okay, very, very nice. How many points do you have in the game? Uh, four. Okay, all right. So you, you contributed. You definitely contributed. Now, do you guys have a starting senior center? No, I'm the oldest center. Okay, wow. So you guys are a young team this year. So uh, do you think you guys will be able to duplicate the success you had last year? Oh, yeah, we're really hoping for a big tournament run coming up this Saturday. We're going to play the first place. Very, so, very nice. A lot of teams are actually like sleeping on this because we had a lot of yeah. seniors. So we're expecting right. to make a big impact for this generation. Definitely so. Most important question, what's your GPA? Uh, I think it's a 2.8. 2.8, well that's good. That's close to a B. That means you've got some room to improve. Yes, Keep up the good work, definitely. Let's get to um, average points a game, rebounds a game up, and definitely take some of these jokers to the hole during the tournament, man. <laughs> Craypot, thanks so very much. Once again, Ed Williams coming to you live in the connecting spot. We are down here at the Duke Energy Convention Center. It was the Mercy Health Black History Month celebration, celebrating history while making history. Magic Johnson, of course, was here. We had an opportunity to talk with him a little bit earlier in the press conference. So, hey, we're going to go ahead and get out of here. Craypot, congratulations once again. You got a photograph. Now, that's going to go viral, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, Paul, let's go. It looks like the team's gotten out of here. Is that the All coach? Right. Thank you, good sir. Is that that's your coach? coach? Oh, no. Oh, okay, cool. Okay. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, good sir. Well, I tell you what. It's a wonderful, wonderful event down here at the Duke Energy Convention Center. And really, this is just the beginning. As uh, Dr. Melvin said, you know, Black History Month is almost over. But that doesn't necessarily mean that we have to stop the trend of supporting and advocating as it relates to black history. Dr. Melvin gave a lot of very, very key facts related to black history and the contribution that African Americans have made to the country and really to the world as it relates to inventions, as it relates to advocacy, as it relates to business. So the, the thing to remember is you don't just have to celebrate Black History Month in February. It's always wonderful to be able to take advantage of all the different festivities and things that go on and all of the recognition that happens in the month of February. But remember, Black History is also American history. So, hey, I want you guys to follow us across the web. Of course, you can always check the connecting spot out live at sbnstudio.com. And we've got all sorts of other stuff going on. Broadcasts like this that we bring to you on location are called the Connecting Spot Vibe Broadcast. 
We are all over town. We've got another big event coming up next week in partnership with the African American Chamber as well as Centos and Nielsen. And we are going to be coming back to you live next week. So, hey, looks like everybody's going home. And I think Greg and I are going to go ahead and go home as well. Special consideration out to my video director, Greg affectionately known as the cameraman Reese video images and pictures video images and pictures and politics Viva Cincy check out VivaCincy.com it is all about Cincinnati so hey we're gonna go ahead and sign off doesn't look like there's anybody else to talk to so there's a little fella running around here he wants to talk he said he's a pirate so I used to play that game too hey we're gonna sign off you guys follow us across the web like us on Facebook follow us on Twitter Instagram LinkedIn all that sort of good stuff have fun the rest of your black history. Yeah, this is nice, man. See, you got a man. I was thinking about that today. You saw my post. I was like, pretty uh -huh. much everything.